huge honor. I get it. Huge honor. Hello everybody, I'm Hugh Jonah and it's a huge honor to show you how to get any of my mods that are on, only on Nexus mods through the in-game mod manager. So first of all we need to make sure that we have a mod.io account that we can access through the browser that is linked to the headset. And the very first time you open the mod manager here, it will ask you for your email. And if you provide that, you can then use that email to access the same account uh, in the browser. If you haven't done that, it will make things more complicated. Um, you can skip ahead if you have a working connected one, otherwise follow these steps here. Alright, so if you skip this, unfortunately there's no way for you to add the email yourself. So even if you delete the game and delete the data, it might come up with the pop-up again. But even if you type an email in there, it won't actually link it to your account. It will have generated an account already and linked it to your Meta ID. And therefore, even if you reinstall the game, it will connect you to the same generated user. But all hope is not lost. Mod.io support can actually connect uh, an email to your account or merge them with another account if you already have one. Uh, but they will likely need your Mod.io username. To get your Mod.io username that has been generated when you access this, I've made a simple mod. Uh, unfortunately, it requires a scripting beta, but feel free to just opt in for that mod and then opt out again and delete the mod. It is literally just for finding out the username. All right, so we head into the mod section. Make sure that you're on the scripting beta. Type in mod. IO, make sure you have scripting selected. It will come up with this mod IO tools. Okay, you install that one. This mod is installed, great. And I will get into the game and show you how to find out the username. All right, now that we're loaded into the game, you can open the settings, head to mods, you'll find this new mod here, mod IO tools, and it will just simply state your username here that's generated for you. So all you need to do now is contact Mod.io support, give them this username and say you want to connect an email to this one. Alright, as simple as that. Once you have it connected, you can follow the next steps. Alright, now that we have a Mod.io account linked to the headset so we can exit it through the browser, uh, we can follow the next steps. So you can do this in any browser. You can do it on the headset directly or on your phone. You open your browser. You head over to Mod.io, make sure that you know your username. So in my case, that is Hugh And then you go over to Nexus. If you don't have an account yet, you can create one. Then you head over to the game and find any of my mods that you want to download. So for example, let's do the arrow trick errors today. Search for them. There we are, arrow trick errors. And the first thing you want to do is download them. Okay, you download the mod. This will just save it on your headset somewhere. It doesn't really matter, you can delete it afterwards. It's only so that the download has been registered. Okay, now you go over to posts. And here's also written instructions on how it works. Essentially, you will just add a comment listing your Morayo username. So in my case, that was huge honor. I'll type that now, boom, and save that. And now you unfortunately have to wait because I have to do this manually. So I will get a notification when someone uh, comments on my mods and then I will essentially grant you access to the mod on mod.io. Um, you, you'll get an email once that is done. Hopefully it won't take longer than a day. I usually check like, pretty regularly. Uh, you will get an email saying Hugh invites you to preview one of his mods. Yeah, like it says here and essentially so you get an email you click on the link it will bring you to this page here and now what you can do is you can subscribe and since this is linked to the same account as you have in the headset if you now go into the headset into the mod section it will recognize you've subscribed to this mod Got it. so let me show you that in here and you should see it's starting to download this, as you can see there. So it's simple as that. To recap, 
make sure that you have a Mod.io account that you can access through the browser that is linked to your headset. You can test this, by the way, by just subscribing to any other mod and see if it shows up. Then you need to head over to Nexus and download the mod that you want and make a comment on that mod listing your Mod.io username. I will then grant you access to the Mod.io mod and after you've received the email you can click on that link that link will lead you to the hidden page and you can then subscribe once you've subscribed if you enter the mod section in the headset it will auto download and that's it i hope you enjoy this well any of my mods and yeah i hope you find this helpful as always it was a huge honor